and we're three months past due on our bills. How do we get so behind? It's because you don't have a job. You don't have a job either. My job is to sit here and look pretty. Well, you don't do that job very well. <gasps> Marvin, go get a job. Well, no one's hiring. When's the last time you tried? It's been a long time. Hey, Danny, I need a new TV because the TV in my room is broken. How'd you break it? I don't know. Come see. <sighs> Jeffy, I don't notice anything wrong with this TV. You don't see that? See what? The big axe mark right there. No, I don't see an axe mark. You don't see this? <laughs> Jeffy, what the hell's wrong with you? I can't help it. It's my brain. My old mommy said it was broken. Oh, your ass is about to be broken when I beat it! <laughs> I can't believe this. <laughs> What's wrong, Jeffy? Okay, calm down. Take a deep breath. Now start from the beginning. Daddy hit my TV with an axe and broke it. What? Jeffy, you are so grounded. Marvin, how could you break Jeffy's TV with an axe? Oh, hell no. I didn't do it. He did it. Don't blame Jeffy. Yeah, don't blame me, sh Jeffy language. Marvin, we can't afford to buy Jeffy a new TV. You hear that, Jeffy? We can't afford to buy your new TV because we're in so much debt. Well, then why don't you go get a job? Because all you do all day is sit on your butthole and scratch it and sniff it. Yeah, Marvin, you need to get a job. Well, no one's hiring. Well, let's check online. Oh, look, Marvin, the neighbors across the street are looking for a pool cleaner. I'm not going to clean their pool. But they're paying $50 an hour. That's a lot of money. Well, go across the street and see if they'll hire you to clean their pool. <sighs> oh, okay, I'll go over there. Uh, I can't believe I'm doing this. Hello, hello, welcome to our home. Go to your room, Dad. Yes, Father. You sound like <laughs> and practice your vocals. Sorry about that, Marvin. Uh, he thinks he's going to be part of the Sydney Opera one day, but he's got a lot of practicing ahead of him. Okay. So, what do you want, Marvin? I'm here for the pool job. Oh, yeah, the pool job. Better be grateful that you're not here for the rim job, because my tires are dirty. <laughs> so, can I go see the pool? Yeah, the pond's back this way. Come on, Marvin. Okay. Okay, Marvin, you see the leaves in the pool? Yeah. Well, I'm going to need you to get them out with this thing, just like this. See that? Oh, that's easy. Oh, yeah. All right, now you see the leaves at the bottom of the pool? I need you to take a snorkel and go down there and get those too, okay? Okay. All right, and if you need anything, I'll be mowing my lawn. Why didn't he just hand it to me? Oh, pool boy. Yes, ma'am. Why don't you come over here and put some lotion on my back? Well, ma'am, I, I really just need to clean the pool. That's my job. And my front. Uh, ma'am, can you please put a shirt on? That's very inappropriate. Oh, come on now. Don't be shy. Well, do I absolutely have to? You want to get paid, don't you? <sighs> on your back? Yeah. Mmm, that's nice. Now get my front. Uh, you, like, you want me to touch your... Mm-hmm. Well, I have to go use the bathroom. Well, hurry back now, you rascal. Honey, are all the leaves out of the pool? Oh, that sexy pool boy's just lazy. I told him to get those leaves, and he's been taking a bathroom break for over an hour. Uh-uh-uh. People just don't want to work in this economy. You go get them, honey. I will. I'm going to put a hucker new foot down. <sighs> so weird. So, Marvin, did they hire you? What? The neighbors across the street. Oh, no, they already hired a pool boy. There was someone already doing it. Oh, that sucks, Marvin. That's okay. We can keep looking. Oh, look, Marvin, there's a dog pooper scooper job. I'm not going to pick up dog poop. <laughs> oh, Marvin, go get the door. Well, I, I really don't want to. Please, Marvin. <sighs> okay. Ugh. Hello? Now, Marvin, I gave you a fantastic opportunity to make money getting the leaves out of my pool. Now, gosh darn it, why couldn't you do it? Well, you see, Mr. Huckerdoo, I was just uncomfortable with... Uncomfortable getting in my pool? Oh, you can't swim! No, I can swim. Nothing to be embarrassed about, Marvin. My wife is a phenomenal swimming instructor, and she'll have you swimming by the end of the day. No, no. She can hold her breath for minutes. Believe me. No, you don't understand. I I'll send my wife right over, and she'll teach you how to swim in your bathtub. Oh, no, 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 no. Baby steps, Marvin. Baby steps. No, no, I can swim. Don't Send her over. Oh, darn it. <sighs> Who was at the door, Marvin? Oh, it was uh, Girl Scouts selling cookies. Ooh, did you buy some? No, we can't afford it. We're in debt. Oh, but I like cookies. Well, how about you like air? Because air is free. <gasps> hey, dang. I just realized that you pay $994 for gas when I have some gas right here for free. <laughs> yeah. Oh, you're disgusting, Jeff. You're so disgusting. Oh, Marvin, there's someone at the door again. Oh, no one answered. No one answered the door. Why? Because since I didn't buy Girl Scout cookies, they said they were going to hire a gang of guys to beat me up. Oh, don't be ridiculous, Marvin. I'll go get it. No, don't answer. Don't answer. 
Marvin, you didn't tell me you couldn't swim. I know how to swim. You don't have to be embarrassed, Marvin. Mrs. Huckerdoo came over and told me they hired you for the pool job, but you quit because you couldn't swim. Oh, is that why I quit? You don't have to worry, Marvin. You'll be swimming by the end of the day. I'll go draw a bath. I'm not taking those swimming lessons. Marvin, go take your lesson. I know how to swim. She's lying to you. So what happened? Okay, look, they did hire me for the pool job. So you lied? Yes, but that's the only thing I lied about. Everything now is the truth. So they hired me for the pool job, and then she wanted me to rub lotion on her back. Yeah, so she wouldn't get a sunburn? No, it was not sunscreen. It was regular Lubriderm lotion. Marvin, I'm sure it was fine. No, and then she rolled over and wanted me to grab her boobies. Marvin, you don't have to make up stories because you don't know how to swim. I'm not making up stories. I know how to swim, and she wanted me to grab her boobs. Marvin, go! take your swim lesson. <sighs> okay, can you come watch? No, what are you, five? Okay, look, come check on me in 30 seconds. What? Bubbles? Baby, I'm not doing these swimming lessons. Marvin, get your butt in that tub. <sighs> Hey there, big boy. But why are you naked? Because clothes restrict your swimming abilities. I suggest you take yours off, too. No, and why are there bubbles in the tub if I'm trying to learn to swim? Because bubbles help you float better. See? Now give me some sugar. Oh. <laughs> Get off me! Ah! Okay, that is it. I am done. What's wrong, Marvin? She tried to make out with me. What? That is not true. I was helping him because he doesn't know how to swim. He was drowning, so I was giving him mouth to mouth. Marvin, you're freaking out over a little CPR? She put her tongue in my mouth. This is the worst case of hydrophobia I have ever seen. I recommend he never get in the water again. Marvin, it's okay. You don't have to feel bad. I know how to swim. Everyone's lying about me. Um, Marvin, before I go, do you mind if I borrow a cup of sugar? Okay, baby, you go get it. It's in the kitchen. What? I can't reach the top shelf. Okay, look, I will go get the sugar, but I promise you she's going to end up naked. Marvin, don't be silly. Just go. <sighs> Okay, there's the sugar. You can have all of it. Well, I only need a cup. Will you pour it for me? <sighs> oh, no! I think some got on my dress! Well, you got in the way! Do you mind if I wash my dress here? You live across the street! But my husband will kill me if I sing this dress! It won't take long! No, 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 don't, don't, and she's, she's getting naked. Where's your washing machine? Uh, it, it's, it's over here. Okay, your dress is in the washing machine. Can you please cover yourself up with that towel? No, it's already too hot in here. Kind of like you. Okay, listen. I'm married. You're married. We can't be doing this. I hate my life. I hate my husband. All he wants to do is mow that lawn of his. I need a hardworking man like you. I'm not a hardworking man. I wouldn't even clean your pool, remember? Mm, man, that mustache. Shut up and kiss me, you fool. Uh, Marvin, come back. Uh, Marvin, did you give her a cup of sugar? I sure did, and now she's naked in the laundry room. What? Hey, Donnie, while you and that lady were in the bathtub, I was hiding underneath the water, and I saw a hairy octopus with no legs. So I just saw a hairy puss. Jeffy! Well, I don't remember seeing that in my zoo books. Marvin, how could you leave her naked with no clothes after ruining her nice dress? I didn't ruin her dress, she ruined it. And it was just sugar, she could have wiped it off. Well, I gave her one of my shirts to wear. Okay. Can you walk me home? It's dark outside, and I'm scared. No, you can walk yourself home. Marvin, don't be rude. I'm gonna be rude. I'm tired of her, I don't want her to come on to me, she can walk herself home. It's just across the street. That's fine. I'll just go. Oh, no, Marvin. She left behind her pearl necklace. She did that on purpose. You need to go give it back to her. No, we can mail it to her. Marvin, they live right across the street. Okay, I'll go outside and I'll throw it in their yard. You better not, Marvin. Okay, look, I'll take it over there, but I'm only going to give it to the husband, not the wife. Okay. <sighs> what the fuck are you doing here, Marvin? It's late at night. You're over here banging on the door. Kids are sleeping, being loud as shit. Oh, listen, I just came here to give your wife a pearl necklace. Oh, the pearl necklace, that little thing. Come on inside, take a load off, get something cold to drink. I don't want to come inside. I, I want... insist, Marvin, come on. All right, Marvin, pop a squat. You want some of my Fiji water? No. All right, well, let's get down to business. Let's cut the bull. We're both men here. My wife's trying to sleep with you. I know, and you're okay with that? Yeah, I've cheated on my wife countless times. Too many times to count on one hand. Well, count on the other hand. Oh, well, in that case, six. I've cheated on my wife six times, and I'm giving her a hall pass to cheat on me once with any guy she wants. She wants you, Marvin. I'm so honored. You should be. This is your one opportunity to do a hucker do. I don't want to do a hucker do. I want you guys to leave me alone. Well, I need you just to hurry up and get it on so I can get over it. You hear that, Marvin? The night is young, and so is our love. I just came here to give you your pearl necklace. You want to give me another one? Well, I'm going to go upstairs and blow my brains out. All right, listen, why me? Why are you choosing me? Because of that sexy mustache, Marvin. You're so manly. Okay, what if I find you a guy with a mustache? You can do him. No, I only want you. Oh, okay, well, I, I, I have an idea. How about we turn off all the lights, and then, oh, I, I will give you that, that mean sausage. Okay, Marvin. Okay, let me go turn off all the lights. Don't keep me waiting. 
Okay, all the lights are off. Can, can, can you see me? No. Okay, that's good. Okay, I'll be right back. What? I'll be right back. You just stay naked on that couch. You keep it stanky. Okay, I'm gonna go get Chef Pee Pee and I'm gonna ask him to do it. Who the hell spilled sugar all in my kitchen? Hey, Chef Pee Pee. What do you want, Marvin? I'm trying to solve this mystery. Oh, uh, I need your help, a big favor. I don't have any money, what do you want? No, it, it does not involve money. Listen, so the lady across the street, she sells uh, uh, solar panels. Okay. And she said she'll give me 50% off if you do the nasty with her. What, me? Do the nasty? I'm a nasty individual, but why me? Uh, she said that you're the sexiest man on the planet. <laughs> she ain't lying. I guess she's speaking some facts. Yeah, so can you go over there and, you know, do the thing with her? Uh, okay, okay, I'll do some things with her then. Okay, come on, follow me. Okay, she's in there on the couch. Ooh, all I gotta do is go in there and give her that Chef Pee Pee loving. Yeah, but please don't talk. Oh, she don't like to talk? She just gets straight to business? My type of girl. Also, whatever you do, do not turn on the lights. Come on, Marvin. I've never been a fan of the lights. Come on. And she might call you Marvin. Wait, wait, what? I told Told her your name was Marvin. Ew, that's weird. But listen, just go with it. Like, just get in the get in the groove, you know. All right, all right, I could do that. Yeah, I'm gonna let that dog out. But please don't do that. Look, but she loves your mustache. She wants you to go crazy with that thing. Ooh, she a freak. The mustache. Yeah. So hold on. All right, here I come. Go, 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 go. Marvin, are you here? Yeah, baby, I'm here. I heard you want some pay pee. What's with the accent? Oh, oh my bad. Uh, let's get down to business. Don't mind if I huck a do. Ah, <sighs> finally, that situation's over with. Marvin, I got her dress out of the dryer. Do you want to take it over to her? No, you can take it over to her tomorrow. I think they're sleeping now. Marvin, I came by to get my dress and to tell you that you were magnificent. What a man! Marvin, what is she talking about? Uh, I went over there to give her her necklace and she gave me one more swimming lesson and she said I'm magnificent at swimming. Yeah, he was. Well, I'll see you later, big boy. Bye. Oh, Marvin. <laughs> Man, I'm in love. Man, you are a true friend. Thanks so much. Oh, I hope those solar panels are worth it, too. Wait, we're getting solar panels? Oh, no, 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 we're not getting solar panels. I realize we're in too much debt. We can't afford it. Oh, that sucks, man. Uh, yeah, well, if you know any girls that work at these places, holla at your boy. I could probably get you 50% off, you know? Give her that business. <laughs> that business. Uh, you know what I'm talking about? Uh.